this is what we do. Uh, this is day one of me trying to get this to work right. Um, everybody else has a YouTube channel. I'm just trying to set it up, see what I can do. Um, <laughs> I don't know how it's going to tell you the truth. Um, I'll let you know. Um, it's, you know, it's recording. It's saying I'm doing it live. I'm trying to see it on the page um, to see what's going on. To see if I can see it. Um, but I'm not seeing it just yet. So I'm trying to see um, how I do that. Uh, so maybe it's because it says it's live on my phone. You know, I have a Note 5, it has that feature where. Um, you can do an automatic live stream and I know it does it I just wanted to get on my computer to see um, if it if it is um, let me see here sorry this is like I said this is all new to me not really planning on anyone to watch this because this is trial and error right here but for people that's wanting to get into the business of doing this um, yeah it's it's not for the faint of heart. Um, it's camera on and off. Turn your camera. Use your camera to record reactions. It's recording. Okay. So basically, I got it. It's live streaming. It is live streaming. However, it's not going to show up until I hit the stop button on my phone. It's good to know. So anyone that is trying to get into this business like like I'm doing right now if you're doing it from your phone and you don't have a fancy four hundred dollar camera and a setup like some of the subscribers the people that I subscribe to like uh, Collider Video shout outs to John Campia and his camp um, that is by far the greatest uh, YouTube channel that I've seen ever um, when it comes to talking about movies which is my passion um, they do it better than anybody else and you know it's not even about agreeing with everything that they say because you know I watch their show all the time and I I would say fair amount I agree with about 80 to 90 percent of what what he what he states in his uh in his videos like he's 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 he nails it and the thing i like about him is that if he's talking from just his own opinion he'll throw it out this is just what i think so people are not taking it like bible you know um and that's one of the things i like about him that's that's um and not just him um john snap hilarious dude Reminds me of some of my friends. And um, um, one of my favorite comedic people they got on there is Mark Ellis. Um, <laughs> I sound like a fan because I am a fan. And um, I love what he does. I watched him when he was on AMC Movie Talk. And um, I was just watching a video, matter of fact, of him talking about how to do it. A lot of people asked him, how do you do what you do? And he was very straightforward because people want, they want a handout. Everybody. It doesn't matter what race you are or what religious background you got. People look at famous people or people in position of power and they want that handout. Instead of really wanting to know the craft, they want them to be like, boom, this is three steps to how you can be me. <laughs> and he said it straight out. It's not for the faint of heart, really hard work, time, love, dedication, tireless hours. Not everybody does it, not everybody makes it. And that's just what it is. Not everyone could be um, Cinema Blend, Coming Soon.net, Collider Videos, AMC Movie Talk. These are, these are formats. You know, not everybody's Fox News, not everybody's CNN News. 
um, you have your place. Um, but what he said, to sum it all up, is be true to yourself, to thy own heart, be true. So for people that want to go out there and do videos, I see a lot of reactions as a lot of people that have YouTube channels. And it's pretty amazing, actually, 2015 coming to a close. And it's hundreds of thousands, if not millions of people that got videos that they're doing big things. You know, um, if they're talking about movies or talking about fashion, sports. What I, what I um, was going to do, what, what I'm getting into doing, and I'm laying the groundwork now, is to get into something similar of what John Campy is doing. I, I'm not a fan of copying other people's work. Um, me, I love movies. Um, and there's always going to be film critics. There's always going to be people commenting on movies. Um, I wanted to do that, and I wanted to do more. I wanted to get into politics. And the thing, and what I want to bring to the table is not just a degree um, basis. You know, a lot of people come in with a political science degree or if in the sense of people talking about movies. You see a lot of these channels, people have a journalism degree, people have this kind of traditional background. Um, I want to bring the real raw, in the street conversation. I want to converse about a great many things. I want to talk about what the ground people are talking about, the middle class citizens are talking about. Um, and that's the format to what the show is going to be about. Um, I don't have a name yet. Like I said, this first video is basically trial and error. Trial and error. <laughs> trial and error. Sorry. Um, and I'm, I'm going to review it and see just where it goes from there. You know, um, it's just me and my, my house. So I'm not in the studio. That's going to come later. You know, God willing, that's going to come later. Um, a little background about me. I'm from Brooklyn, New York. Um, and you're going to see that I have a, a little flavor of what I do. I'm not a comedian, but people do tell me I'm funny. Um, I'm not expecting to be funny to people. Some people might find me funny. Um, I do plan on having friends come through, give their opinions, people that want to be on camera. There's some people that don't. There's some, I got some friends that's, <laughs> they're like, no, I don't, I don't want to do it. Um, but that's my plan so I guess this first episode and this is Jay you know my friends call me Jay so um, this is Jay real talk is what I was looking at calling it I have to look around and make sure that I'm not um, stepping on any toes with that if anyone else has that name or rights to that name I don't want YouTube to shout at me and be like whoa what are you doing so um, this is just starting out Boom. If you liked it, if <laughs> me not talking about anything, um, it's, it's what is it, 2.30 in the morning, Nebraska time. So um, I got to head to bed. But I just got this up and running. So this is something that's going to be a work, a work of art for me. Um, and you can share your comments. One thing I've seen in, in YouTube you got to have really thick skin because I've seen a lot of people's pages, even even the big boys, where they got just people to just hate. I don't know if they get paid to just go on everybody's page and just spew venom. Like, I, I, I feel bad because I see some of their comments and I'm just like, it doesn't even make sense. It's like you go to, I was just watching a reaction on the new uh, trailer and one of the people commented about race had nothing to do with the review and they just throw in something about race or they throw in something about religion or, or you know it's like what are you talking about what does that have to do with what they're talking about so it's like people just get on shows like you go and watch a video a music video on YouTube and you look at some of the comments and people just come in with hate you know it doesn't matter or someone does a karaoke or a cover to a song and someone just shreds them just oh it's horrible and it could be very beautiful but it's just it's it's sad it's sad and 
I I totally expect to get hated on. I totally expect people to be like, what is this dude doing? Um, and it's not going to bother me because some of the greatest people out there have the biggest haters. So um, I take it as I take it with pride. I take it as as energy to keep pushing me to strive to be better. So do your worst, you know. Um, I think the good as long as as well as the bad, you know. This is the world we live in. So um, I'm gonna put this up and see how it goes. Um, like I said, when I start this show up, and I'm gonna I'm gonna get back to y'all and let y'all know what the real name is. I'm gonna it's gonna be more professional than this. Uh, like I said before, just to recap, it's gonna be Street View. Um, and I don't mean that in the loosely saying a ghetto sense. Um, when I say street, I mean the, the regular people. You know, I I get this sense of when you watch things on TV, it's fabricated. People call me a conspiracy theorist. But in all, the truth of the matter is the media lies. It, we call it propaganda for a reason. It's propaganda. I mean, they're not really telling us the truth. And um, same thing with a lot of film critics. And I'm not trying to blast people, but this is real talk. This is why I say it, because people will rate movies, and it's just like, I can't tell you how many times Rotten Tomatoes was wrong. <laughs> like, I go see a movie like, whoa, they missed it. Gave it 12%, and it was really good. Like, Pixels. I thought Pixels was a pretty good movie. Like, me and my friend Chad went to it, ex didn't know what to expect. We were just like, it's a great concept. Great concept. They set a great premise. And we went in there presently surprised. Like, just like, whoa, Adam Sandler did his thing. I'm not saying it's the top 10 movie of the year, it's in the top 10, but it was good. It was refreshing. You know, I mean, we're getting to the point in Hollywood where so many remakes, so many reboots, sequels, you're not seeing a lot of originality or the originality that you want to see anyway. Um, so. You know, that's the that's the the foundation work that that's what my show is going to be about is getting you know the blue collar perspective on things. Again, I'm not talking about the whole world. Sometimes I might dive into it. I can go off on a tangent, but I I really my passion is movies. And every now and then, if something hits me, like that stuff that happened over in California just recently, um, this stuff talking about NSA, watching cell phones, they, the new candidates on the GOP is talking about re-implementing that, you know, things like that might, <laughs> I might have to throw my hat into the, you know, into the um, conversation. So, um, as you can see, I could talk. Hence me having the channel. Um, but like my page, you know, um, I'm putting it out there. So let me know what you think um, on the introduction so far. Uh, and like I said, in the next couple of days, I'm going to start doing episodes and, and start kicking out stuff to really get people, you know, talking and give you something to comment about. So thank you. Yeah, have a good night or good morning wherever you at in the world. And I'll check y'all out later.